Could social media offer key insights into designing for niche guests? That's what we were going to discuss this week on The Draft. Thanks for joining us for another week of The Draft with Valet Academy. I'm Scott Valentine, and today we're going to talk about how social media can impact the design of your hotel or hospitality business. What's been the biggest innovation in hospitality design in the past two years? Augmented reality? Personalization? Wrong. Thanks to the increasingly deep insight it provides into the future mindsets of users, Instagram is having a greater impact than any of the others combined. For every designer that appreciates the importance of creating experiences which are eye-catching enough to be shared on social media, there are plenty of those who hold their nose up at the idea. Yet using Instagram to inform your design isn't just a frivolous fad. It's basic business sense for two reasons. Firstly, 1 billion active users on Instagram offers an extremely cost-effective PR platform. The only thing Instagram is asking in return is that you design your space in a way that stands out at least enough for them to stop for a couple of seconds, take a picture, tag your location, and then share it with their tribe. Our previous Instagram design guide takes a closer look at some of the best ideas to make your space more visually appealing and photo-friendly, indeed Instagrammable. But as part of this episode, we're more interested in the second reason, which is Instagram can provide you with valuable insights into the emotional and social psyche of your future guests. Elements to elements you can then incorporate into your design. Before you start framing your design concept, you need to be crystal clear on which niche you're designing for. What are the needs and wants of the niche when they visit your location? What does remarkable look like in their world? In our recent niche design guide, we provided a step-by-step -step process for getting under the skin of your future guests and sketching out some very detailed user personas. When it comes to finding out what those future guests find remarkable, we recommend pinpointing where they currently spend their time and then taking a closer look at the Instagram accounts, location tags, and hashtags associated with those venues. By scanning and analyzing existing posts, you can pull out valuable information about the type of experience your future guests will find remarkable enough to document on social media. For example, at Valet, we categorize posts according to whether they're focused on the person who took the picture, the exterior of the building, interior design features, the pool, outdoor areas, signage, natural environment, cityscapes, or even the way food is presented. This reveals certain patterns to which you can then replicate, not imitate, in your design. The more pictures you analyze, the more data you can collect. Of course, you don't need to scour through thousands of pictures if you don't have the resources to do so. A sample of a couple of hundred pictures, classify them by, classify them into themes, will give you an idea of what your niche finds visually appealing and share with their tribe. As an example, imagine a fancy-free, footloose millennial, thrifty destination junkie. Often traveling around on their own with a small group of friends, they're tech-savvy social media addicts who want to be in the thick of it. Typical examples of the type of accommodation they choose are places like La Pirate in Indonesia, um, this is in Lombok, and there are city hotels like uh, Yotel New York. A scan of La Pirate shows guests are more excited about the surrounding beaches, turquoise waters, and beachfront hammocks than they are by the food, room design, or interior design aesthetics of the resort. Their Instagram behavior demonstrates this niche prefers experience over luxury. Indeed, La Pirate shows that if you have a hotel own a hotel and it's blessed by an awesome location, you're best off blending your design in with the, the natural environment, thus creating a high remarkability factor among this niche. A different climate and a more urban setting, but a similar approach is taken by Yotel. Searching hashtag Yotel New York shows plenty of skylines, cityscapes, and quirky design features in common areas. But Yotel visitors uh, also appear to be drawn to its compact, colorful hipster guest rooms. Indeed, Yotel shows that clever artificial light has an immense impact on how thrifty destination junkies experience a space turning into a highly remarkable, Instagrammable experience. When designing a city hub aimed at attracting a young, mobile, and trendy crowd on a budget, it's worth spending extra resources on reflecting this niche's mindset of want to be part of happening and a funky place. Yotel shows us that clever lighting can play an important part of this. There are many factors to take into account when designing a building, but all too often, the experience of the future guest is overlooked. Instagram offers a great tool for understanding the kind of experience that your future guests desire when they step through your doors. 
by analyzing the hashtags of similar venues, you can figure out at an early stage which design features are likely to get your most traction on social media. So play around with the idea, find out which venues your niche is currently visiting and check out their hashtags. What are the common themes? What are the, what are the ideas that you can replicate in your own design? Let us know in comments below. We're keen to get your feedback on this idea and thank you for joining us on another week of The Draft.